Here's how to make a toggleable object for VRChat in under 3 minutes. First, put the object you want on your model and parent it to any bone you want. For this, we're going to choose a plushie. Then make a menu and parameter list. If you already have them, skip this step. In your menu, make a control with whatever you want to name it, set it to toggle, and set the parameter to a name that corresponds with your object. In your parameter list, create a new parameter, set it as the boolean, and set the name to the same one you used for your control. Go to your avatar, click Customize under Playable Layers and Expressions. Drag the menu into the menu slot and the parameter list into the parameter slot. Next, click on your avatar, go to the Animations tab, and click Create. This will be the On animation. Click the big red button to start recording, click on your object, click the check mark to hide it, and click it again to unhide it. Then, copy the keyframe by selecting it and pressing Ctrl C. In the dropdown, click Create New Clip and rename it. This will be your off animation. Paste your keyframe and turn off the check mark in the animation. If you already have an effects controller, skip this step. Duplicate the hands template and drag it elsewhere in your project. Rename it to FX, followed by your avatar name, and put it on your avatar like so. After that, double-click the effects controller, go to parameters, click the plus, make a new boolean, and set the name to the same one as your previous parameter. Then in layers, create a new layer, rename it, and set the weight to 1. Grab the two animations we made before, and drag them into the empty space. Space them out, right-click the off animation, and click set as layer default state. Right-click one of them, select make transition, and click the other one. Do the same with the other animation. Select the transition going into the on animation. Turn off has exit time, set the transition duration to zero, and click the plus button at the bottom. In the drop down menu, select the parameter you just made and set the state to true. Then go to the top, right click your transition, and select copy transition parameters. Select your other transition, go to the top, right click, and select paste both. Go down and set the state to false. Now to test it. I use Gesture Manager, which is a free Unity package linked in the description. Go to Tools and click Gesture Manager. Select it in your scene and click Enter Play Mode. You'll be able to see your menu you made like it would be in VRChat. Go to Expressions and click the button you made. Your object should now toggle. If you like this tutorial, feel free to subscribe for more like it in the future. That's all for today. Crispy, out.